Hey everyone, if you are a mom and you are celebrating New Year's here, I have a suggestion of what I feel can really make a difference to your 2023 in terms of being the mom your kids deserve to see and being the mom you maybe truly are and just haven't seen enough of. If you've been feeling like you're losing it too much or you're impatient or you're coming through the holidays and just feeling exhausted, I feel like this is the perfect time to take stock what's working and what isn't one of my favorite practices and then i'm going to tell you one of my favorite questions i'm going to invite you to ask yourself this year is to review the holidays and really say what worked and what didn't and then to actually take action now for next holidays so for instance i left my christmas cards way too late especially for my international family i have and so this year i went back to my calendar for 2023 and i put it in earlier and made a note but then there were some also things that I was like, you know what, I did stockings for everyone. Do I really want to do that next year? And this year I was like, you know what, I don't think I do. What would light me up more is to take herbs out of my garden and make a special like Italian blend. And so I started to actually put those in as well. So that's my suggestion to you. What's worked, what isn't? Is there anything you want to let go of completely and want to make yourself a note of in October of 2023? This is the time to do it. And finally, I saw a quote that I thought was especially important for us moms who are busy, who maybe are overachieving moms, who have very high standards for ourselves and for our kids, and it's this. Usually we make resolutions to change ourselves. This year, why not make a resolution to be more of yourself? And the question I have for you is every day, what if you asked yourself, like, what would I do today if I was my most authentic self today? Some days that might be you're really pissed off and angry and maybe it's not taking it out on others, but to actually write it down and just get it out. Other days it might be like, you know what? I actually don't want to go to that thing tomorrow. And you call ahead of time and reschedule it or cancel it or change it. I don't know what it is for you, but I feel it's important that you know what it is for you and to start asking better questions daily so you can make those shifts you and your kids deserve. I wish you a very, very happy new year. And um, if you like what you see here and want more, visit me on joyfullyparenting.com. I've got a free training program of how to get your stubborn child to listen more. And uh, I'd love to see you there. Bye.